surprised this evening to be here celebrating the wedding of two people who have been close friends of mine for many years. Kathy and I have known one another for close to 10 years, while Bill and I have been friends for virtually half my life. Throughout the years, Bill has been like a brother to me. In fact, the only difference between our friendship and the friendship shared by brothers is the fact that we fought much less frequently. <laughs> when I was thinking back to the time when Bill and Kathy met, I suddenly realized I may be somewhat responsible. You see, when I was a sophomore in high school, for one reason or another, I decided to get a job at McDonald's. <laughs> in addition, I talked Bill into getting a job there as well, which is where he and Kathy met. Of course, my intentions weren't noble. It was merely a matter of misery loves company. <laughs> Inevitably, love bloomed under the golden arches. <laughs> and Bill and Kathy formed a relationship that, even back then, we all knew would lead to marriage. Eventually, Kathy sought bigger and better opportunities elsewhere, and Bill didn't hesitate to follow her out the door the day she left. At this point, there was no doubt in any of our minds that this was true love. Why else would Bill be willing to give up a job that paid three twenty-five an hour? <laughs> but in all seriousness, anyone who even casually observes Bill and Kathy will notice that their love is unparalleled. When I look at Bill and Kathy, I know the soul behaviors which display how very much in love they are. I knew it when they first met, and I knew it now. Bill and Kathy were meant to be together forever. Words could never fully express the happiness I feel for them on this day. Bill, Kathy, I wish you both the best of luck, and health, and prosperity in the future, and may all your dreams become reality. Having a real big round of applause for our best man. Nice job, Vince.